Hello, I just wanted to make an additional uh, technique to our lapping plate. Um, this technique um, was explained to me by Christian Timms at Japanese Tools Australia. Um, it's a method of imparting some grip from a water stone onto the lapping plate. Now, as you know, our lapping plate comes with two sides. One's got the crisscross um, cutting groove side and we've got the plain side. Now, the cutting groove side is probably not the right side for this process because a lot of the grip will go into the grooves and won't be on top to do the job. So we choose the plain side, the ground side, wet it with some water and then pick up the, in this case the 1000 grip Shapton Pro Series stone and rub it onto the plate. After a while you'll get a little slurry working which is really grit from the 1000 grit stone onto the lapping plate. Now that's got a nice slurry now. So then you take your chisel and work it up and down or around. This process is good because that way you don't get a ledge along the back side of the chisel and it starts to polish with 1000 grit. Now starting to get a polish there now. What you can do is also do the backs of plain blades up and down to get a nice flat finish on them. You'll find you need a little bit of water to go along because it dries out and that will start polishing the black of the plain blade. Now what you can do after you've gone through a process getting some finishes on the back, you can wash this off and then use a finer grit like a 4000 grit or a 5000 grit stone and then go again which will make your polish even better. That's a good process, it works really well and um, just another one of the techniques you can use with our lapping plate.